This travelling stock reserve is about 16 kilometres from Armidale. It's in one of the key areas of koala significance that we've mapped. Travelling stock reserves in the past have predominantly been used for stock, grazing stock. More recently, we're starting to see the other values used for conservation and there's some of the last remaining biodiversity hotspots, I guess, and the valuable wildlife corridors connecting places within the landscape. This project is part of the Cool Country Koala project that Local Land Services delivered this year. We're putting in wildlife friendly fencing so we protect not only the koalas but the gliders and the birds. It is really important that local land services get behind this project and support it and do our bit for the conservation of koalas. Put in over 4,000 koala tree species, so we've planted some TSRs around Armidale and Guyra. We're at Salisbury Waters Travelling Stock Reserve, south east of Armidale. It's part of a section of TSR, it's five and a half hectares, is the portion that we've recently fenced off through this uh, Cool Country Koalas funding program. So five and a half hectares has been excluded from grazing and, and prepared for planting. There was a program run by the Armidale Tree Group. It runs along this water body all the way back to Somras and the aim was to revegetate all of that. There's been some plantings done just over the hill on a, the rest of this travelling stock reserve and this is the next uh, stage in that program. This is the, the public land contribution to this and we're only a small part of that, that area but doing what we can. The neighbours of travelling stock reserves have always make contributions and, and are a big influence on the way the sites are managed, so they've been great collaborators in this site as well. Both sites were very difficult. We were actually quite lucky because it was such a wet season. And they both required minimal disturbance because there was already an existing ground cover species there that we didn't want to disturb. We did have to go in and hand plant a fair bit, so we used a, a range of equipment. We used a, a little mini digger to actually auger out holes to plant into. I think we did about a third of each site with that, and then the rest of it we used hand-powered tools to, to dig the holes and, and put them in. Here we're at a TSR just out of Liston. This travelling stock reserve has been specifically set aside for koala conservation. We've taken it off the long-term grazing permitting list also a critically endangered ecological community. There's been koala sightings recorded here over the last few years. The area had been overrun with lantana, so we've come in here and sprayed about 120 hectares of lantana. Here's a coffee bush. We identified that as a key native species in this community. Spoke with the contractor and we were able to avoid spraying any of the native understory species which will benefit the long-term biodiversity of the critically endangered community.